Welcome back to another Audacity tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to record the sound from your computer. So if you're playing music on your computer, you're watching something online on Netflix or on YouTube, you can actually capture that audio that's coming out of your computer playing through your speakers or on your headphones. Um, so basically anything on your speakers you can record in Audacity. Um, to do that though, you'll notice under the microphone, we have to change so that we're listening to our audio card on our computer and not listening to the microphone. So right now if I hit record, I'm recording from my microphone only. And if we come here to uh, um, audio file under music, I have like this uh, audio file, it's a MIDI. So we can hear it, but if we hit record, it didn't, if we hit record now, if we play this back, uh, but if we hit record, See, it didn't catch the audio from the speakers, even though you heard it in my uh, uh, in this tutorial. We didn't capture it on Audacity. So to change that, what we need to do, um, let's just go File New. Let's bring up a whole brand new window. We go to Edit. We go to Preferences, and under this Host, um, yours might be different. And in fact, this these instructions will probably only work on Windows now that I think about it. But we need to change our host to this WASAPI Windows. So if we change that in here, then under recording we get some different options. We still have our microphone, but we also have the speakers. We have a loopback. I have two actually. I have one for my Rode microphone, but I just have this regular speaker slash headphone and it's my Realtek audio. So Realtek's a common um, audio interface. So I'm going to select this and now when I say okay, now when I record, first of all, if I hit record right now, testing, testing, one, two, three, nothing's happening. If we hit stop, it doesn't record anything at all because there's nothing playing. There's no input at all on this, these speakers and headphones. But now if I go and actually play some audio, So now we actually have this, oops, stop. There we go. So now we actually have this audio that we've captured and we can play it in Audacity. So we can, um, let's see. Yeah, so let's hit play here. Looks like there was a little bit of a hiccup on capturing that. So this is actually doing a lot of interesting things. This is playback. This is a MIDI file being played back and then we're recording it. So we're actually, it's actually stepping through a whole bunch of different audio settings on the computer, different audio processes. But there you have it. And we can do the same thing if we want to come to the end of this. We want to go, we just hit, uh, let's play a YouTube video here, like just one of my YouTube videos. And hit record. So it's actually recording what's happening on the video here. And then we can close this, hit stop here, and we see it's actually recorded this different audio. Welcome back to another so we, we, just, we effectively just recorded audio from um, a YouTube video and from a MIDI file being played back on our computer. Uh, so that's how you would do that. And so just make sure you can change this. And if you don't have an option to record from your speakers or your headphone, or sometimes it's called the name of your audio interface, then just go to Edit Preferences and you might need to change your host to something different. And on, on Linux and Mac, I think on Linux you can just do it by default, uh, at least on depending on your what distribution you're using. On Mac, I'm not exactly sure. But I'm going to change mine back here. Uh, but yeah, that's how you do it. Uh, I guess one more thing I'll say, if, you need to, if it's still not working, you can always right-click down here where you adjust your volume. You can right-click, and then you can go to Open Sound Settings. And you might have some different options you can play around with in here as well um, to choose like your, your default. Or if, you're, if you're still not able to record, you might just need to go into your sound settings is what I'm saying. And you can maybe play around with um, changing different things there to see if you can get it to work. So I hope you found this video informative. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. And I hope to see you in the next video.